Okay, I thought I'd do this. Um, actually, before you know, before pulling the trigger on the money, kind of gauge interest if if anyone wants me to, you know, if it's if it's going to be worth me getting getting all the trackers and stuff because I'm actually using um, the Oculus Quest um, as opposed to the Vive stuff just because it's there's like zero setup. I'm using like the virtual desktop to go into Steam VR and then launch the um, Ruckle Open VR recorder. Um, so that's all seems to be working. Um, so I just need to find the re record button. Um, it's also, I think it's got audio coming through. And you can see the my headset and the two controllers and the data that's coming in, the coordinates and everything. And it's those coordinates we're going to be streaming. Well, I would be streaming into. Um, Blender uh, uh, using the open VR, uh, open sound control method. Um, but because this is the beta version, it doesn't support the that streaming thing. But I thought rather than let's 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 do a bit of capturing um, and then save the FBX, take that into um, into Blender and see how easy it is to do some sort of puppet. So this is like the first part. Okay, so. There is this is a start record button right there. Um, so let's give that a go, and then we'll have ten seconds. So oh, just he's dancing or something. <laughs> okay, that's done. Right. Okay, that's okay. I'm gonna take the headset off because it's a bit. Well, this is a bit of a mess, and um, it'll be easier just to do it on the computer. So I'm just gonna stop the recording. I found the playback button, it's here, so you can see, and you can render it out as a, that's quite good. I mean, generally, it's really well put, this guy really knows his, his stuff, I mean, uh, you know, he's obviously used professional systems and stuff, but to me, yeah, it, it's, it, it's, yeah, pretty amazing job he's done. Um, okay, export, import, FBX, um, Desktop import. There we go. We have 10 seconds of me at the correct scale moving around. So, so now you can see that those could be end effectors. Um, let's make this a bit longer. We have 10 seconds after all. Uh, so, what's that like? 500 or something? Four seconds. Okay. Um, yeah. So I mean, I, I you know it's pretty cool. Um, <laughs> and so the reason why um, I'm using the Quest. Oh, it stopped. Six hundred. Oh, maybe I. Oh, that's strange. How have we got no keyframes on that? Um, but yeah, the, the the thing is, I I do have the Vive, but it's such a hassle to set up. Because you have like these like breakout boxes, and you need all the leads, and the, I mean I've got the two lighthouse base stations, but I'm kind of part of me is thinking, look, I'm I'll buy the knuckles controller, and then I'll be able to do the fingers, um, and uh, I'll have to buy two steam dongles to make that those those work, um, and then I'll buy the the Tundra VR trackers, maybe go with a four one, like that. Um, and that comes with its own. Bluetooth dongle, um, and then that will give me um, the well. And then, I, and then I, I, you know, I don't need to even wear the headset at that point. I don't think I can just launch Steam VR, um, and I'll have uh, five points. Well, I have the four Tundra trackers, so one on each foot, one on the, on my hips, and then uh, and then I'll have the um, the index controllers. Uh, and I'll have on that foot. foot for my hands and and that will also be able to do the fingers and then I'll probably use the the fourth tracker for my head and won't bother wearing the VR stuff at all really I'm just using it for the to capture the data and so that's it really I mean you know I'm, I'm I, I like I say this is just I, I was kind of wanted to gauge how much interest there would be in this sort of thing really before like spending loads of money I mean I really want want the gear right of course I do but it's a sort of thing of like there's lots of things I really like I'd like to get a new camera and all the rest of it but that's how easy it is. Uh, okay, I hadn't shown you. 
the, the really interesting thing would be to see if we can get the open sound control thing to work but that feature doesn't work in the in the demo version of uh open vr recorder so I, i'd um i mean i could still i could still buy the open open vr recorder and see if i could just get that feature to work um so the sort of coordinates come streaming in uh, using the open sound control protocol to the end and factors of some ik um bones or something um okay i'm gonna stop the video there um just quick update so it might happen it might not happen it really depends if, what my bank balance says but I, i'm kind of i want to give it a go but um it's just at the same time if there's not much interest um yeah maybe maybe do something else